Hello and welcome to this new video about the brand new game Think by Toppy Games, Humans versus Artificial Intelligence. So, what's this game all about? Well, it's quite simple actually. As you can see, I've got a big deck of cards here. Um, it comes with an egg timer and I'm also going to need a pen and some paper. And that's pretty much all we need to play the game Think. Um, we're going to play in six rounds, and for each round we have a different category of words. Um, on each card you've got n words numbered one to six, and they go in order from different categories. So category one is fauna and flora or food, category two is entertainment, then we've got a word from daily life for category three, then we've got science and nature, number five is history and geography, and number six is news, society and economy topics. So for round one, uh, we choose word number one off the first card. Round two, we choose word number two from the second card and so forth until we've done the six rounds. Before we play, we're also going to choose our game mode. So you can play in easy mode, which means you're trying to get 30 points. In average, you want to get more than 50. For experts, you aim for 70. And if you're a genius, you are aiming for more than 100 points over the course of the six rounds. Um, now we're playing, um, we're playing collectively because this is humans against artificial intelligence. So at the end of each round, um, we'll add up our points all together among the players um, and uh, add them together as we go through the different rounds to see if we can beat artificial intelligence. Um, so let's, let's give it a go. Um, I'm going to draw the first card. So category one, food, fauna and flora. The word is Jaguar. Um, so uh, now I'm just going to flip the egg timer and then I've got 30 seconds to come up with as many words related to Jaguar as I can possibly find. So let's see. Um, it's an animal, so I'm going to write animal. Um, it's a feline, so feline. Um, it's, it runs really fast, so fast. Um, it's yellow. I'm going to write yellow. Uh, what else? What else? Oh, it's also a car brand, so we're going to write car brand. Um, do I have any other right? Oh, it's a hunter as well, it's a hunter. Um, and let's imagine that the 30 seconds is up there. So I've got one, two, three, four, five, six words. Um, and now we're going to compare with the words that ChatGPT came up with on the other side of the card. So what did ChatGPT find related to Jaguar? We've got mysterious, Powerful, stealthy, a loner, predator, elegant, agile, spotted, carnivore, hunter. Oh, that's one that I got. Muscular, fast. I also got that one. Gracious, nocturnal, discreet, wild, independent, fearful and impressive. Mm, that is impressive. Well, um, I got two words in common with ChatGPT. So for those two words, I'm going to get one point for each. So that's two points. And I also got four other words that ChatGPT did, did not find. So I get two points for each of those. So that's two times four plus two. That gives me 10 points in total for this round. I add those together with any other players that are playing with me against artificial intelligence. And we hope to reach the 100 points by the end of the six rounds. Um, that's pretty much how you play Think. Now, there is a nuance. Um, if there's a few players and you want to play in teams, you can, of course, team up uh, into humans against humans against artificial intelligence and play it that way as well, in which case you're trying to beat the other human team and beat the artificial intelligence. Uh, but if you do that and you are in a team, um, you each have your own separate piece of paper, you write down your separate words, and then you compare them afterwards. And if you've got any words that were the same as your uh, your teammates words then you'd get three points for those words there so that's the that's the nuance when you're playing in team mode so it's pretty simple really it's a really fun game um, great for friends and family there's 18,000 words uh, in this pack of cards and who knows you might come across a word you've never seen before in which case don't hesitate to look it up on the internet or in a good old-fashioned dictionary um, and tell the other players what the word means. Have fun and um, I'll see you soon.